So here we are backstage at the Sound of Music in Melbourne and we're here for our backstage tips video and I'm with the amazing, wonderful Lorraine Bailey. Now, some of you would remember Lorraine, of course, as I do, as Mrs. Sullivan, probably your most you famous Grace. role, <laughs> Grace Sullivan. So what we want to just ask you, Lorraine, is, I mean, you've been in this industry uh, for so many years. 60. 60 <laughs> years. So who better to give us some advice about performing, um, preparing for performances? Ladies what what, what, what sort of things do you do you have to prepare for a performance? Well, I'd be ready for your half hour call. Always be on time. Um, make sure you go to a good school and get a good teacher that you can get a good rapport with. Um, you do have to work hard um, if you want to last in the business and not just be a one-shot one day. You also must do some kind of body movement, dancing classes or something like that, so your body is flexible, so that you're able to isolate different parts of your body depending on what character you want to play. And it's also important to take speech lessons um, so that you can get different voices. You know, you can get little high voices if you want to, or you can get little low, deep voices if you want to. But again, it's so that you can play all sorts of different characters. But you need that, particularly in Australia, because uh, there's not such a huge number of shows for all the actors that there are. So the main thing is do, do all those things and don't just go once or twice. Keep it up so that when luck, as they say, comes your way, you are prepared, you are ready, and you'll go in and wow them and just have a wonderful career. I wanted to ask, um, you're playing Frau Schmidt in, in The Sound of Music at yeah. the event. And, oh, I love it. And, uh, you know, it's, it's a joy to be able to share the stage with you. And it's obviously played a, um, along others, you know, many other actors in this business. What's the most important thing that you take onto the stage with you? I think one of the main things when you're performing is to um, have a very good rapport with your other actors and that can be a joy as well as a, a job. Um, and when you're working with somebody, be as honest as you can in the performance and work with the other person. The days are gone when you would just, you know, talk out front and, you know, mm. act like that and say your words lovely, but with nothing to do with the other actor you're working with. Work with the other person and you can work off of each other. Mm -hmm. And then you can build a scene and that will take the audience with you. And uh, then you know, the audience is there to be taken on a journey, whether it's a funny journey or a dramatic journey or whatever, but give them an experience. And when you're working with somebody else, that draws the audience in so much. It does. Um, not all scenes require this, you know, but on the scenes that are, look at this person, take in what they're giving you so that you can build on what they're giving you instead of just an imaginary what you think yes, exactly. they're, they're thinking. Yeah. And at the end of all that, you get this wonderful connection with the audience and that's what's important, you know, that you're, you're there to entertain. Exactly, that, you said it exactly because that's it. You are there for the audience's benefit, yes. not your own. Well, that's wonderful advice, Lorraine. Thank you so much for joining us at Backstage Tips. <laughs> My pleasure. Thank you. And it was lovely working with you too. Thank you. It was fabulous working with you and all the best for the rest of the season. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs>